the mukbang rebels and we're eating for a cause. We keep our portions small so we can stay in charge of our health, our wealth. We're going to start a trend to keep eating healthy until the very end. Hey, Welcome everybody to my channel. Today our um, food to make was, uh, it was chicken and vegetables. Chicken stuff with vegetables is what it was. But if you are one of the people as a Muppet Rebel that aren't really a cook, and hold on, let me show you this. This is fried chicken and fried vegetables. It's baked chicken. It's ch baked chicken that's uh, tenders that are I sauteed and and uh, some garlic. And, so there's garlic sauce, Italian seasoning. You're gonna hear my little dog muffin running around playing with their ball. All right, so I'm the kind of person that you're gonna find who, thank you Jesus for this food and bless it to the nourishment of my body in Jesus' name, amen. Okay, who um, will try the simplest way of making things and fast because I'm on the go a lot and I'm not a person who, um, I mean, I will, I, I have, but I don't take a lot of time in my cooking. I'm the one that you want to watch to hurry. <laughs> so, this is so good. I fried my veg vegetables. I have some green peppers, red peppers, onions, and I have it sauteed with, uh, in some olive oil. And, um, look at a napkin. Um, olive oil and, uh, garlic. And, it, and some, sea, like I said, I think I said Italian seasonings. Oh, core water. I'm not sponsored. Wish I was. Um, so anyhow, this is what I did. I made it easy. If you notice, I make everything easy. I'm uncomfortable. I'm sitting on a stool and it's not comfortable. That's why you see me move all the time. All right. Cheers, you guys. This is good. I never even offered you a bite. It's like rude. I'm so rude. Jackie's so rude. Here you go. Look at that steam. Now, if you know me, you know I'm not a big meat eater. So if I eat meat, it has to be usually, if I eat real meat, it has to be like chopped up in little pieces. So that's what I did. And season the heck out of it. It's about the texture for me too. This is so good and healthy. I mean, it's just... And you guys, I'm going to tell you, I cheat. I just used a bag of the already cut up peppers, already cut up onions. I fried them in olive oil, and I fried the chicken breast that were already pre-cooked. Threw it together. Didn't take me long. I just got back from the eye doctor appointment and went right to it. So, this was very good. So I'm mostly the basic mukbanger. I make things very basic. Very easy if you're in a hurry. Um, that's why the mukbang girls is so wonderful because maybe you're gonna wanna throw something together. It's, it tastes like a stir fry, actually. My dog. This is so good. Well. On a happy note, I haven't been to the eye doctor in probably four years, three years, four years. I finally did it because my eyes were just getting bad, I felt. And I think mostly it's because my glasses are scratched to heck. So... The eye doctor said that my prescription hasn't changed very much. That it's pretty much the same. Um, I'm farsighted. Um, so, and you guys, these are Invisalign. These are like bifocals. I don't need them from far off right now. But, I'm eyes to see far off right now. But, he said, the last time I went in, she said, or he said, if you're ever going to get them, someday you might get them. I was used to it now. So it's really for a computer and up close, but I can see far away pretty good. This is good. Mmm. Um, I just want to thank everybody who has come together on the Smuffing Rebels. It's not for everybody, but when you jump in and it's for you, 
it's a good thing. It's a sweet deal. Because you can learn about everybody's um, recipes. Learn new ways to eat. Things you might not have thought about. It is so windy here. We have what they call it a red flag wind day in um, Omaha and it's my city and the surrounding cities. Um, 50, 60 mile an hour and fire warnings because you know how California when it got real dry and they got those fires. I guess we're really dry. Which just the other day I had to wipe a buttload of mud off my dog's feet so I don't get that but. Anyway. Thank you guys for watching. This is so good. I'm anxious to see what everybody else is making. Thank you Tosh Time for helping us to become aware of healthy eating. Um, we're just trying to encourage maybe somebody who felt like they maybe were alone in the battle of eating healthy. Maybe they see all these other mukbangs and they're like, but I want to do that because that was so good. And it, and it does look good sometimes. But let's get on the healthy train and try that too. I feel better. I have more energy, and you can doctor it up how you want, and some things might not be for you, um, but anyway, guys, I don't want to keep you, let me take a drink, I might eat all of this, I have more in the pan, I'll have to share it with my family, um, this was so inexpensive to make, very easy, <laughs> very basic, and it's very good. I mean, look at the colors. It's so pretty. I will eat this whole thing. So, I use olive oil. It's a little healthier. Um, just a couple tablespoons. Okay, guys. And lots of seasoning, you know. Italian se I wanted Italian seasoning today and garlic. I was going to bake it, but I wanted it the way I had it. I'm lazy, guys. You know, I, I want to get, I want to eat this and I want to get out of there, get ready, clean up a little bit and go do my workout. So, hey, we're the mukbang rebels and we're eating for a cause. We keep our portions small so we can stay in charge of our health, our wealth. We're trying to set a trend to keep eating healthy until the very end. Thanks guys. Have a good day. Watch everybody else too, please. Bye-bye.